In this video, I'm going to talk to you about how to build early number fluency and recognition. So first thing is finding some fun and functional ways in your everyday life that you can incorporate fluency and recognition. Um, that might mean looking for numbers around the supermarket. It might mean talking about units of measurement when you're baking with your child. It might mean asking your child to find something that's heavy or something that's light. It also might mean while you're out walking with your child, talking to them about things that they're going under or things that they're walking over. Uh, in terms of other resources that you could print off in addition to this, something like this simple number writing practice you can find on the internet. We use this um, in the class for number formation. But at home you could print this off and using Play-Doh you could get your child to form those numbers or you could get them to look at this sheet and to help guide them um, tracing numbers in sand or in dirt. Or when you're baking you might spill some flour out onto the bench and get them to trace the numbers in the flour. Some other ways to encourage fluency and recognition with numbers with your children is on a clock. This is a teaching clock that we would use in the classroom but you can use your regular clock at home and just talking to your child about um, the numbers that are on the clock, maybe asking them what number comes after a number or what number comes before a number. Um, another way is finding shapes around you, around your house, going for a walk around uh, your local area and getting your child to point out shapes that they can see, uh, making patterns with objects that they have at home with their toys, or other ways that children can um, improve their fluency and recognition.